Hey, what's up guys? It's Andrew and today I'm going to be showing you how to install the replacement lock screen high locker. Now what this does is it pretty much has all the same features as the stock lock screen along with app shortcuts, customizable wallpapers, and the ability to add your owner information to your front lock screen so in case you get you lost, somebody can easily give it back to you. Now this is a free download from the Play Store. So just go ahead and open up the Play Store, search for high locker, and then install it. After it's finished and installing, go ahead and open up the app. Alright, now when you first open the app, you're going to have to enter your name. Now this is going to appear on your lock screen, so if you don't want it to say your name, you can just change it to anything you want, or just leave it blank. Now all you have to do is just go through the quick setup. Now this is just pretty much give access to notifications and allow you to override the security of your phone to replace it with security through HiLocker. All right, now that it's set up, you're pretty much all good to go. And um, in order to use notifications on the lock screen, if you swipe to the left, it's going to open the app. But if you swipe to the right, it's going to dismiss it. Go ahead and check that out. And you're going to also want to set up your security. If you don't want to have your phone left unsecure, you can have to choose from a pattern or a pin, which are going to look exactly the same as the stock Android version of them. So you can go ahead and enter that, and you also have the ability to lock your status bar, so you won't be able to pull it down from your lock screen anymore if you don't want to. You could also set up a trusted Wi-Fi area, so that whenever you're connected to a, a Wi-Fi access point that you know, you can go ahead and disable your security completely. This will be good if you're using it at home. And as far as editing that message um, that we set up in the beginning, you just go ahead and go to the edit, medit, edit message section and you'll be able to change that. You can also add a personal message on the lock screen as well in case you still want to have your name on it. <clears throat> Along with the message, you could also customize the clock look and you could also change the way your weather looks as well. You could completely disable the weather if you don't want that on there and you could also change it to Celsius instead of Fahrenheit if you live anywhere else other than the US. As far as changing your wallpaper you can do it through the main settings you have to go through the edit wallpaper through HiLocker. Go ahead and check any of the ones that come by default or you could also add your own. And under the more section you could actually customize the way your wallpaper looks even further by enabling the blur effect or disabling it and you could also enable double tap to unlock if your phone supports it. And last up, we have app shortcuts. Now these are going to work the way the Sanogen and Mod Lock Screen app shortcuts work by pressing this and then just going to any of the apps. Um, your best bet is to leave um, the top one to unlock in the phone just so that you're not locked out. And the other four could be used for anything you want. Keep in mind that the default dialer and camera shortcuts are disabled. Um, those are the ones that are usually on the lollipop lock screen, so if you're too used to those, you might want to keep those, so you're going to be down to only having two app shortcuts. Alright, so now that my lock screen is set up, I'll go ahead and show you guys how it looks. So this is the default wallpaper that comes with it. You can see here that up top I have the date, time, and um, my local weather. And at the bottom I have my shortcuts that can just easily unlock or open up different apps. Alright guys, and that's going to do it for High Locker. Be sure to check out the full guide linked in the description below. And like always, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, guys.